fat mum picked McDonald's over her kid's life. Now that's a mother I like. Ugh. Get that quarter pounder inside of me. Mom, I can't eat anymore. Why are you stopping now? You need to eat 500 more burgers? I already ate 50 burgers. Just 50? You're a dis- I wonder what this narrative is. How how a grown man or grown woman has created this YouTube short and they're like, you know what would be great if my mum was a McDonald's addict? Not a Burger King, not KFC, McDonald's, bro. And it'd be great if she had a Karen haircut and just showering her kid. You're a freaking disappointment. The bar ain't very high. All you gotta do is eat that freaking burger, dude. Disappointment? Huh? I better eat those 495 burgers that are left. I think I'm going to pass out. What is bro supposed to do? He's eating the leftovers of the nation's burgers in McDonald's. What has he eaten? All he ate was 50 burgers. 50 burgers? Ma'am, he needs surgery immediately. <laughs> 50 burgers? Not that life-threatening disease. 50 burgers? Now, I see that a lot. Not a kid doing it, but a man. They're always like, hmm, it would be great for a Wednesday afternoon for a YouTube video if I eat 50 burgers. That's my new video. Hi, guys. My boyfriend's an addict. <laughs> Luckily, the surgery only costs two hundred dollars. So he's ate fifty burgers. His mum's like two hundred dollars for this surgery. I think this needs to happen. Oh god, his cholesterol's too freaking high. All right, let's figure out what happens next. Two hundred dollars. Will she pay it? Dollars? I could buy one hundred more burgers with that money. I'll pass. Okay, she thinks sort of purely burger-based diet. I respect it. She's got the physique of a goddess. All right, the burgers. That is her forte. Uh, and this Karen will continue to eat burgers until her child dies. Confirm. Illuminati. Let's get it. I'm the surgery? But miss, this is life or death. He's your son. Okay, I can always make another. That is a motto my mum always used to say. That's all right. I'll just bath another child. That sounds all right, doesn't it? When the doctor cares more about your kid than actually the mother does, that's messed up. That's okay, though. That's messed up. It creates a good narrative for the Roblox short, I think. Gets the kids watching, you know? Just pop out another one. I will not let this child die. I'll get the money for your surgery, kid. I'm glad I didn't pay that money. Ha, huh, you fell for it. Fell for what? I poisoned the burger and only I have the antidote. You <laughs> <laughs> it's so stupid because it's like a Batman storyline. Ha <laughs> ha, I have poisoned the burger, Joker. Get wrecked. The, the doctor cares more about the kid than the mother does. The mother goes back to work. She's eating more burgers. She dies from eating the burger. Well, actually, no, she doesn't die. She's poisoned. Temporarily. She's okay, YouTube. Don't demonetize me. And only he's got the antidote. We gotta find out what happens next. Give me the $200 for your son's surgery, and I'll give you the antidote. Fine here. Take the money. Comment if I shouldn't give her the antidote. Mom, I can't eat- Comment if I should give her the antidote. Well, I'm glad this is all fictional, because if there- if this was an issue, there'd be child line. There would be um, the NHS on the line. There would be... God, who knows? This is one messed up short. I want you guys to tell me, what is your favorite song right now? Anyway, let's get into this video. Today, we are reacting to Roblox Brookhaven. We're going to be looking at the shorts. I am someone who is brand new to Roblox. So what do I need to do? I need to learn. And of course, I'm going to go straight to YouTube shorts. Am I going to regret this? Possibly. But like my father always said, get on that grind, Fred. That's a weird saying. He never said that. Anyway, uh, here we are. Roblox shorts. Some look interesting. I have no idea if I can react to them or not. <laughs> The first one, spying on online daters in Brookhaven. Is it really that bad, the dating scene? Piggy, she's a player. Little Miss Piggy, she's beautiful also. <laughs> she's my best friend. We're dating. No, we're not. I'm not dating a pig. Spying on online daters in Brookhaven. All right, let's see what this is all about. Where is my mom? As he's going through a billion pound house. No, billion dollars, sorry. Oh, so his mom is cheating? Okay, we have quite the scenario here. Let's just say that. So you, well, you're running through the house and you're just like, I know, I'll go into the bathroom. Oh, there's someone showering there. I'll just go in there anyway and see what happens. It's just mom and dad in their, in their swimming trunks. Just chilling. All right, let's see what happens next. I wonder how, I wonder why. Yesterday you told me about the blue. Oh, uh, okay. My mum loves dancing in the shower. I forgot about that. Mum, you could just slip and die. You could break something. Like, I don't even know if that's my dad. You know, is that my dad? Are you my dad? 
Oh, is that all I gotta say? Oh my god. It's like you could be speechless, but you could just say a caption like, oh my god. And just watch your mum dance in the shower. Interesting. I said, get out. Mum just punches me. Interesting. Well, if my mum looked like that, I'd be running the other direction too. Jesus Christ, I just got punched and I'm on the floor. I'm bleeding out, mum. And, and mum's new date is behind me. I have no idea if that's my dad or a Tinder date. You know what I mean? Okay, interesting. That's the end of that story. Let's see what people have to say about that. Eight-year-old girl dating a 50-year-old man. Hey, what's wrong with that? There's everything wrong with that. What the frick? Nah, that's messed up, bro. Yeah, that, that's messed up. Oh, mom, where are you? Oh, you're in the shower dancing again with a stranger. <laughs> ah! These online daters be wild. Bro, they're more than wild. They're clean. They're clean and disgusting. Age is just a number. You know what else is a number? What? <laughs> 911. Hell freaking yeah it is. Jesus. Get this man. Get him some handcuffs. All right. Well, that was Bunny Plays. Thank you, Bunny Plays, for that scenario. Dream scenario for Dream. My ego crush broke my heart. See, that's something I'm becoming more aware of is the online dating space. E-girls, wow. Uh, I guess there's a bit of a fetish online for e-girls. Uh, electronic girls, that stands for, by the way. Pretty strange. Pretty strange. It's just kids without dads or mums or I think orphans pretty much. Just going, ah! You know, in Roblox, and it's just like, what the frick? That's fatherless endeavors, bro. No, just be a child, man. Be a child. Just go to the park. You don't need to worry about an ego. All right. The ego's probably 50 year old man anyway. So, yeah, uh, let's check out my ego crush broke my heart. My wife said she would leave me if I didn't get my riz back. So I decided to go to the. If I had a soul and is existed inside of my body, I think I would have to get some pizzas and take it out. Okay, because this really hurts my soul these type of shorts. Obviously, they're completely fiction. It's for kids. I understand that. The Rizzy Riz Lord. Let's find out what the Rizzy Riz Lord wants to do with an ego. The Riz Doctor and get some lessons. But the lovely dressed lady said my clothes look like dog water. So no, nah, dog water, bro. It's not that. It's a freaking credit card. Get your money up, bro. That's what I'm saying, man. See, Brookhaven is only so big, all right? And it can only contain a certain amount of Riz. If you Riz too much, You'd be risen the way off. You you could be risen too hard or risen too little. All right, there there's parameters to it, man. Uh, but if you need to go see a doctor about some riz, then you freaking messed up, bro. All right, you could do other things. You do push-ups. That will get you some riz. And then just chat to some lovely ladies. All right, there's your riz. Just ask them how the day is. Not um, hey, sweet baby cheeks. What on? How are you? That would mess up the conversation. The girl would just want to slap you and run run away or block you on roblox okay the rizzy riz lord is back again call me the riz lord so she took me to get some fresh drip and said i look like a snack now but okay all right if you look like a snack you look like a granola bar you look terrible but oh my god what is that smell all right we gotta find out what the smell is there's the letter but that's funny because smells and fart then she said i stink so she invited me to her house to wash up like in some okay that is synonymous with sex. Am I, am I allowed to say that word? Probably not. <laughs> Interesting. The man has no riz, but yet he's found himself going home with the Rizzy Riz doctor. Hmm. Interesting. This man has untapped riz potential. Let's find out what happens next after we like and subscribe. Sub in the next three seconds if you think this girl is an odor. <laughs> Well, I think you were right. Because while I was washing up, I caught her spying on me. I can't show you the spicy baka here. But you can see... Spicy baka, man! What is that? Herbs and spices? Bro, I don't understand this. The man has untapped potential with Riz. And he's found himself in the shower whilst the Rizzy Riz doctor is spying on him, her. <laughs> I think there's something wrong with this doctor. Can we all agree? She's there in the same room with binoculars. First of all, she needs to go see an eye doctor. Second of all, that's a child. 
back home! See it all by watching the full video by clicking the link in the pinned comment or at the bottom of the screen. All right, well, that's just clever. That is good promotion right there. I, I don't go to these legs to promote my own videos, but I should. I should be taking notes because this is how the Roblox community works. Girl spies on guy. Oh, come click on my video. Rizzy Riz. Weird strict dad in Brookhaven. Hashtag Roblox. Hashtag Brookhaven. Hashtag edit. I think this is based off a game where it's like angry dad or something like that. I never got to play it, but if you guys are interested, let me know in the comments down below if you want me to play it. It's like angry dad or something by a guy called Quimic. We're going to trust Quimic for some entertainment right now. So like and subscribe on this video. Here we go. <laughs> What is that? It's like default Roblox characters, bro. Spend some money on some Robux and get that good old costume. Like, literally, how... Do I, you can't even go back on a shot. This is terrible music. So, he's going around the house. He's cleaning it all up. For whom? For their dad. Well, there's two of them. That's going to make the process easier. That's like two Mrs. Piggies working together. Damn, I would love to see that. Right, so they got home. They're in the garage. They've, they, well, they parked in the garage, got out the garage, and now they're, they're tidying up. They're cooking dinner, and now they're doing the laundry. These just sound like good individuals, good Samaritans. Like and subscribe this video. I but then, yeah, who comes knocking at the door? Let's find out. Is it Angry Dad or Angry Mother? Under who's knocking outside. Dad will go outside to check. You can watch TV if you want, but you better be sleeping before 10 p.m. Or Dad will be really angry. Dad will be angry, girl. Dad's gonna be angry, but I've tidied everything up. What could go wrong? Let's find out. This is a Messi from the FBI. FBI. What the frick is going on, bro? Was that dad? I'm so confused. I thought it was like two sons or something. Two, two, two brothers in love. No! What the frick? What's wrong with you, Fred? No, just tidying up the house. And now they're turning out the lights. And now they're scared and stuff. And hitting the door with their head. Wait, what? That makes sense. It's it's a guy, it's a, it's a hooligan out there ready to kill anyone. Oh no. Okay, that's actually quite, that's some prime entertainment right there. That was actually good. If I could replay that, I would, but shots don't let me. They don't let me. That is my favorite sound effect. Sad, it's sad, but it's true. Oh! Oops. I am sorry, Dad. I knew Dad was invincible, but also, son, you're awake. And then, like, the son gets up and then just gets a gun. Bang, bang! Sorry, Dad! Even though I came from your nutsack. What's going on? Who is making these storylines? Apparently, Quimic, it's a little bit loose in the head. On to the next one. Oh my god, I know. I, I, I don't know how I'm gonna recover from this. Watch this video if you're there. Ah, I actually just pulled a bit of hair out and I tasted it. That's freaking disgusting. But if you enjoyed this video, let me know by smashing that like button down below and subscribe. All right, we are so close to 1500 subscribers. So help a guy out and subscribe, you know, and leave a comment down below on what my next video should be. I'll give you a shout out. All right, guys, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, everyone. Bye.